All right, so we have the move slide angle. This is gonna be the option right here for allowing the player to go to an angle, and if the angle is great enough, then the player will slide down the angle, and you, you'll be able to choose the angle as well. Um, there's two options in terms of how you slide. You can slide automatically, which means that when the player hits it, he'll just start sliding. Or you can do a manual slide, which means that when he gets to a spot, if you push down on the joystick or uh, down on the keyboard, then he'll actually start to slide down. Uh, the other options are whether or not you can jump from a slide, and then also whether you have a control when sliding, meaning you can break out of a slide. Uh, if these are disabled, then the player would just be uh, on the ride the whole time until he gets to the bottom of the slide. All right, and then the edge depth distance is just checking for how far is it uh, checking below the player before uh, it determines if he can slide or not. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at this part right here. We'll just do a quick example so you can see the slide uh, working. The, we'll, we'll take a look at the other the other variables as well, which are going to determine how fast he goes down it and things. So for instance, currently he won't be able to slide down here. I'm pushing down because this angle isn't actually great enough for the uh, slide. Now if I check on this one though, he goes through his slide. And he changes to a slide animation plus he has a, uh, a finish animation so he'll slide and then he'll have a stop get up animation and then he goes back to his move animation. All right. So that's going to be basically the, uh, the the setup right there for you. So you'll be able to use all of the uh, sliding ability of the player to go up and down these parts. All right. So we'll take a, uh, a look at one more, um, just so you can see the difference between these two, and then we'll uh, work through another set of properties. So if we go down to his slide ability here, so we did manual it last time. Let's go ahead and do auto. All right. So when we do automatic, we're just simply saying that we want the player to be able to, uh, whenever he hits an angle that he can slide on, just to automatically slide. So like that one. Notice I didn't push. And if I try going up these, I'm just going to slide back down. Um, you know, you can you can try to force it up, but it'll it just winds up stopping. If you wind up jumping up kind of high, he winds up sliding down there with it. All right, so basic setup for those gives you the option to be able to do auto or manual. All right.